Uh, it was a great match. I mean, Georgia State definitely pulled up a fight. And, um, you know, sometimes when you come in as a favorite, it's kind of tough because, uh, you know, you don't want to take them lightly. And, and we made sure we did not. You know, uh, we know uh, Georgia State has, is a team with a lot of emotion. And uh, we played great doubles. I mean, from beginning till the end, we're on top. And, you know, we were winning on all three courts. Uh, we're able to close it on number twos and threes. Um, so that was awesome. That's what we're expecting. That was our goal to win the doubles point. Um, we played them last year in the semifinal, and I thought the doubles point was this, the deciding point. So uh, we knew that was a big point against Georgia State. Going to singles, um, you know, it's, some guys may have had a, a bad day, but the other guys definitely picked it up. And uh, we started on fire. And credit Georgia State, they fought back and they won second sets on number two and three, and they were winning on number two and five. So they, this thing was pretty close. Um, but uh, at number four, uh, you know, G just came up really big for us, winning six one and a third. Um, just played relaxed and, and, and at the same time very aggressive on big points. So that was awesome. You know, like you said, Georgia State did put up a fight there, and but getting that doubles point and also you know really quickly able to get that second point off the number one singles. Talk about that a little bit. I mean, Daniel's been a great leader for us this year. And, uh, you know, to be able to not only win at number one, but win that quickly and put, put us on the board 2-0, uh, uh, followed by Nacho at, at six. So being up 3-0, uh, you know, when you're the, when you're the uh, losing team, it's tough. You got to win all remaining matches. So we knew uh, from a mental standpoint that, uh, you know, we had the edge over there. And our guys just, you know, kept on putting the pressure on and on, and it paid off. So that was awesome. Talk about what it means to advance to the uh, championship match for tomorrow. I mean, it's good. You know, at the beginning of the year, we, we talk about the goals we want to achieve. And, and, you know, we didn't talk about making it to the final you know we're talking about winning it uh, Lafayette is a great team um, but we did beat them during the season so uh, but it was extremely close so tomorrow we expect nothing but a great match I mean both teams are very uh, competitive and aggressive and uh, it's going to be an emotional final um, well yeah Georgia State we knew them from last year and uh, we knew it was a very tough match and uh, I thought we came out playing really well we got the doubles point and uh, I thought everybody was in a good groove, and then in singles, we got a couple of, uh, couple of early breaks, and then uh, kind of went from there. We got 2-3-0, and then, yeah, it got a little close, but we had our number four playing a good match and pulling it out. You know, talk about your match a little bit. You know, it seemed pretty crucial there that, you know, to get that early jump, to get the, to get the doubles point, and then for your match to go very quickly. And then South Alabama's up 2-zip. Can you talk about that a little bit? Uh, yeah, I was just trying, trying to play the best I can, you know, and... Uh, Won a few crucial points in the beginning and then kind of got rolling, got some confidence, got some momentum, and then, yeah, just tried to just tried to keep it up and then went well from there. Talk about what it means for your team to advance to the championship match for tomorrow. Yeah, it's, you know, it's our main goal all year long. That's what we look forward to, and uh, it means a lot. Uh, they beat us last year. We're glad we got them back, and uh, we have a big match tomorrow that we're really excited for.